Ooh, baby, it's hot. What up, FBF Squad? It's me, Jacquez, aka Fat Belly Fella, and I'm back. <laughs> Okay, so you guys, how you doing today? How you doing today? How you doing today? You guys, today we are doing something a little bit more unconventional. <laughs> it's called a car bong. Okay? I ain't feel like being in the studio today of mine. I wanted to get out. It's nice outside and yeah. So we're gonna have five guys today. And it's gonna be great. But I don't know about sitting in my car and eating, y'all. I don't know. I've seen other people do that, and it's just, I don't know. It just gives me weird vibes. It gives me awkward vibes. People be walking by acting like they never seen someone eating their car before, you know, things like that, or record themselves. <laughs> but that's what we're going to do today. This is, um, I don't think I've ever done this before. The recording in the, um, the car. Of course, there are things moving around. You guys, this is my car. Welcome to my car. Welcome to my neighborhood. And all of those things. And, um, yeah, so we're on our way to Five Guys. And... It's so hot outside. What's the temperature? It's 89, but it feels like it's 109. I ain't even gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie to you. It feel like it's 109 out here. So, I don't know where the 89 is coming from, but it's getting very, very much so 109. But we're gonna push through. Because we're accustomed to Chicago weather, you know? Chicago weather, if it's, if it's cold outside, it's freezing. If it's hot, it's burning. You know, it's never in between. It's never just in between. Never. And I'm so sick of... Why are you making noise back there? Why are you making noise? I hope that the air is not too much of a problem for you guys. You know, you be having to shade the girls. They be wanting to, they be wanting to ride your, your bumper and be tailgating. That's not what you're supposed to do. You're not supposed to tailgate. That's illegal, actually. Oh no. Oh no. But how are you guys doing today? What are you guys getting into? Huh? There's my eyes. There's my face. I'm really excited for this Five Guys. I haven't had Five Guys in so long. And guess what? Five Guys is not on my shit. So guess what? Yay! We're going to have us some Five Guys. Woo! I did um, run across some um, memos stating that certain restaurants that I had on that. Well, I didn't make that list. Let's just start. Let's just start off there. Let me turn this air down some. I didn't make that list. Okay? That was a profound list coming from a very profound, resourceful resource. <laughs> and hey... But, you know, those restaurants did come out and say that they were not partaking in the festivities. So, some of those places I just may um, pick up again and start doing on the channel, but I'm not 100% sure. Y'all hear the engine reveling? Ooh, I love it. The power. The power. What was I saying? Oh, yeah. But, you know, even though McDonald's came out and said that they weren't a part of that and all that stuff, I just don't really like McDonald's like that. It's just never been my thing. I like the fries and all, but, like, as far as, like, the rest of the menu, no. I'm not too big on McDonald's like that. Not too big. Now, if I could give me a blend of if I could give me a blend of irritating, you're being irritating, you're being very irritating. If I could give me a blend of, um, like, 
a Five Guys burger with some McDonald's fries because you know Five Guys fries are not all that. They are not all that. And um, yeah, if I could have a blend of like McDonald's French fries on top of a a um, Five Guys burger, that would be sickening. Sickening. And I ordered ahead. Because I didn't want to be in this place standing around. Why is it I always manage to get behind someone that wants to drive the speed limit? <laughs> I mean, encourage me to do the right thing, you know, but at this moment, I really want to get to my burger, so it's like, could you just speed it up just a tad, just a little, just a little. And one thing, and then it, like people were like, "Where do you live in the city?" Why well, don't this? I don't live directly in the city. Okay, I live in the suburbs, the suburban area. But the city is very accessible. I just don't reside there anymore. No longer, no longer do I reside in the city, which is a good thing for me. And for my family as well, you know, because it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of funny business that happens, and you know, sometimes you just have to move around for the betterment of yourself. Okay, but the betterment of yourself—it's very important to do things to keep you safe and your loved ones as well. So. <clears throat> That's a story in a nutshell for you. <laughs> oh, it gets deep, y'all. It gets deep. And further down the line of all of this YouTube stuff, you know, because this YouTube stuff, once again, is it's all new to me, you know? And what y'all see right now is very amateur work <laughs> on my behalf. Just like off of just, you know, me being new. I'm just saying it that way, you know? I know what I'm doing. Don't get it twisted. I know what I'm doing, but... I'm new so a lot of things that are uh, currently happen are very current for me so it's like you know I decide on whether I want to express that open myself up to you know put that out into the world you know I'm going through it in the moment so it's like I can't really you know I don't really feel comfortable enough putting it out there right now because listen my emotions <laughs> they be all over They be all over. They be all over. Hmm. We are here. We made it to five guys. We've made it. We've made it, we've made it, we've made it. We made it, we made it, we made it. Oh. We made it, we made it, we made it. Let me see. Do I wanna park here or there? Which where's the lighting? Okay, I'll just park over here because I also wanna sit and chat with you guys whilst whilst I eat. Do I want to park here or do I... I'll park over here because guess what? Or over there. Do I want to park over here or over there? There's too many people. I'll park right here for now. And just go in and get my food. And then we'll figure the rest out later. Dang, why is it so tight up in here with these spots?
It's so tight up in here with these spots. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, I'm not gonna bring y'all in. I'm just going to get my food and I'll be here. Alright, bop. Y'all would not believe. <laughs> I went in there and tried to get my order, y'all, and hold on. Ugh. I went in there to try to get my order and It was like, there's no order here for Jacquez. I'm like, what? Ain't no order for Jacquez. What do you mean, girl? I know I paid for it. Girl, I was on the fat belly. So the lady was like, fat belly fella? She's like, that's you? <laughs> that's me. <laughs> that's me. I love that. I really do. I need to find somewhere else to park, though, because I don't understand why people feel the need to be close when it's supposed to be very much so social distancing I just don't know but we're gonna find somewhere else to park I know that maybe I should park here maybe yeah this is fine no it's not oh no it's not it's really not it's really not and this parking lot is really tight really really tight Really? Really? <clears throat> so I'm gonna go somewhere where I can get a little bit more privacy. Let me go over here. Seclusion. Oh, that is cute. Okay, we have our food. We have our food, and we're about to chow down on some five guys. I have a shit ton of fries, apparently. Rewind, 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 take that back, take that back. If you are new, do not forget to hit that subscribe button and tap that notification bell so you can notify each and every single time I upload another video. And don't forget to leave a comment down below so I know you're here and I can say what's good. Y'all, we're going to say our prayers. We're going to get into this food. Hey, Amen. Okay, so we have fries. I'm gonna get my burger. You know how they just dump the fries off up in here. Lock these doors, girl. I have a um that ain't mine. I got a sandwich. I got a burger for my mom as well. She wanted to try the lettuce wrap. The lettuce wrap uh cheeseburger. And baby, I don't do online. I'm still a growing young man. <laughs> I got the bacon cheeseburger. Okay. We got the bacon cheeseburger. Ooh. Ooh. Baby. 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 How? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, okay, no junior. I'm drinking H2O today. We got some napkins. Got everything else. We're good to go. I really would grab I really wish <clears throat> I had something to put this on so you guys could see it better. Okay, so we got bacon, we got cheese, pickles, uh, 
green bell pepper, jalapeno pepper. And I'm making a mess in my car. Mm. Okay, let's get into this, y'all. I'm making a mess already. Maybe it's best to keep this aluminum foil on. I really hope that you guys can see me. I mean, wow. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna really have to clean my car because My boyfriend is going to kick my butt. He took my car. Let me tell y'all something about a good man. Okay? Let me tell y'all something about a good man. And know the difference. Okay? A good man will see little things that you may be slacking on because you got a million and one things going on in your life, y'all. And it's just the smallest things that, you know, they pay attention to. And they will pick that slack up for you. Now, I had not been cleaning my car. I had not been going to get it washed. I had not been like none of that. I had to get it. He forced me to go get an oil change yesterday, you guys. <clears throat> he forced me to go get an oil change because he was like, your engine lock up. You threw. And I wasn't really paying attention to it until he said something about it. And then once I started to see the light come on. <laughs> Once I started to see the light come on, it was just like, okay, yeah. Yes. So, you know, any other dude would probably just be like, oh, yeah, it's not well. They would just like to drive your car. Not saying he's, he does, like, he has his own. Let's just start there. He has his own. And it's just, I mean, it's just all good. It's just a, it's a different vibe. The whole situation is just different from anything I've ever experienced before. That's how I know that it's the real thing. And he's so excited to meet you guys. But the timing has to be right. This is so bad. And a jalapeno. A jalapeno. She's kicking. She's kicking. She's kicking. Oh my goodness. Very potent. Oh, that's good. H2O. Mm, mm, mm. Don't look, y'all, but these people next to me is watching. <laughs> and where I'm from? Where I'm from, we stare back. I mean, girl, don't over, look, don't look over here like it ain't like you ain't never done it before. Like you ain't never ate in the car before and recorded yourself. <laughs> but 
they don't know. They don't know if I could be on like a FaceTime call or something like that. I could be on live or something. You don't know because you know people is going live like left and right these days. I guess that's the way to feel protected, feel safe in the streets, which is so sad. It's so sad. I'm really praying that the air, because I can't turn this air off, y'all. It is so hot out here. But I'm really praying that <clears throat> I forgot what I was talking about. What was I saying? People are weird. Weird. For no reason. Weird. I will say this, however. I got caught slacking in, in Walmart. I didn't know I had so many supporters like in my city like that. But I got caught slacking in Walmart the other day and I wasn't prepared because you know in my head I'm not thinking about when I step out in public, you know, I just there just might be a chance that I may be wrecking out or whatever the case is, because child, we still we just sitting at three thousand subscribers. Like what are the odds? <laughs> what are the odds of you running into someone? of those 3,000 subscribers, and I know a lot of you guys are not in Chicago, so, you know, I just never think about when I'm going outside, a girl to be looking all cute and jazzy and snatched up and all that stuff, girl, I, don't, I just don't be thinking about all of that, but I got caught slacking the other day, I know better now, I know better now, <laughs> I said, oh, so this is going to happen, girl, you got to be prepared, But I just want y'all to know, like, when y'all do, if you do see me out in public, you guys, listen. I'm as friendly as they come. Friendly, friendly, friendly. Yes, I may have a look of death on my face sometimes, but that's just my face. <laughs> Don't take it to the heart. Don't take it to the heart, you know. I just have a natural mug, you know, but I'm a sweetheart. I'm a gentle, kind guy, you know, so... I know the girl, she was just like, I didn't know if I didn't know if it was okay to come and speak to you or not. And I'm like, girl, it is fine. <laughs> it's fine. I like that. I actually enjoy that. Mm. I really do. I love you guys. And I mean that. I'm not one of them, one of them people that are going to hear talk about some how much they love y'all. And then when you get to meet them in person, they just complete assholes. I'm not, no. Not me. Even on my days when I'm not feeling my best, you know? It's all about showing that appreciation for those who support you. And they don't have to. They do not have to support you. So... I take it within myself. This child is hiding behind the bushes watching me. <laughs> what in the... Maybe I picked the wrong spot. Maybe I picked the wrong spot. What y'all think? No, but this water good as hell. Mm. The temperature just went up to 90 degrees. 
Well, I tell you, it don't play fair. It does not play fair. It does not play fair at all. It does not play fair. And... Y'all, my part of town and in the suburb, the suburb, uh, the suburban area that I am is very integrated. It's a good combination of people, different people. Okay. And the energy just it's just the energy is not off. It's really not. It's like everybody is respectful of each other. Everybody's respectful of, you know, what's happening, of course, you know, everybody's being respectful of that, but that energy, you just, you don't feel that out here, because everyone, everyone out here is really like, it's more so about, everyone is like, how can I put it? It seems like everyone is on a mission, you know? So it's like the last thing on their mind is to be concerned about someone else that doesn't necessarily relate to them. You know what I'm saying? If that makes sense. But I don't know. You don't really hear too many situations with, to me. Like you don't hear situations like that happening here. And I'm not trying to. I'm just. I'm just speaking. Like I'm just stating where I am in life. Where you know about my surroundings in life, you guys. I'm not speaking about anything trying to downplay anything none of that i'm not doing that whatsoever because i stand period but um i'm just speaking on my area and my location you know people here are very there everyone is very respectful of one another and i appreciate that you know because my nieces and my nephews live in this area and it's just like i would go to jail i would go to jail i honestly would i'm not even gonna i'm not gonna hold y'all i would seriously go to jail because those are like my kids. <laughs> you know, their parents are like my kids. So, those are like my kids, you know? So, you know? But it's just like a lot of the stuff that's happening is just, ugh. <laughs> Even still, with the whole situation that happened in, in Atlanta recently, it's just, hmm. I don't know. I never, I never really, you know, I never really got into the whole mindset of why people would be so filled with hate because someone else is the opposite of them. You know, everyone is not the same. Even even if your skin tone is the same, your complexion is the same, your, your your ethnicity is the same, your characteristics may not be the same, your mindset may not be the same. So do we judge those people for that as well? Do we condemn those people for that as well? Do we hate those people for that? I know how I be feeling about it. Very much so. Because I wish I wish I wish I wish I wish I wish I bet. Wow. Let me stop. <laughs> nah, but for real. It's so sad when you have to you have to mentally prepare yourself for stuff like that because you just never know. You might turn around corner and it just be like, bam, I'm right there. You have to be ready. You have to be. It's very unfortunate, but you, I mean, that's just the that's just the reality of it all. That's the reality of it all. Hmm. But. That was great. <clears throat> Actually, 
that was amazing. I haven't had five guys in some months. And I know it's been longer than this 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 pandemic been occurring. So it was well overdue. I'm about to get up out of this joint child. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a comment, like, share this video. Yeah, I don't know why my mind is just not in that space. Because if I was in my studio, I'd be able to just, you know, spit it out. But I can't do it for some reason. It's just different because I'm outside. I don't know. But, um, like, comment, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. So you'll be notified each and every single time your boy upload another video. So I'm going to drink. <clears throat> so. Drink your water. It's very essential. <laughs> Ain't that the word that we use in these days? Essential. It is. Drink it. I made a mess. Okay, I'm about to get up out of here, guys. I hope that you guys have enjoyed this video as much as I have. Maybe we could do a little bit more of these in the future. Maybe when it's, you know, not as hot. You know, not less of 90 degrees, 80 something. Because, baby, that just does not work for me. But in the meantime, you know what's about to happen. You know it's about to go down. <laughs> Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, tap that notification bell, share this video with everyone and anyone and all that good stuff, you guys. I appreciate your love. I appreciate your support. I appreciate this 3K. It's just amazing. You know, it's amazing. It's amazing. It's amazing. Now, thank you to all of the other YouTubers who have congratulated me. And all of that stuff and you know just see it for me and all that good stuff I just, I just I appreciate it it makes me feel good and it makes me feel a lot better about what I'm doing and that you know it's not going in vain I appreciate all of that love and yeah I'm about to go back to my man okay I will see you guys in the next video Praise. Mm -hmm.